All right, what's up, guys? Uh, we're going to mess around a little bit here more with uh, the uh, OTP ballparks. We're not quite done yet. I want to show you sort of how to uh, mess around with the cameras in the ballpark and especially what I do to import stuff. This isn't something I've created. This is just something I've gotten off of the forums. And um, I have a copy both of the zip file and um, I'll, I'll put a, uh, a link to this thread down below. The uh, zip file I'll keep a copy of just in case it's uh, removed. And I'll show you here what I'm looking at. So this is from an old post about uh, almost four years ago now, 3D camera TV style broadcast. This is before OTP had the update where it kind of improved things a little bit. I think it was an OTP 22. Still, these cameras are better, I think, than the ones that come uh, from uh, OTP itself. And uh, so what you do basically is you get the file, you unzip it, you copy into your game, then you import into the game, and then you copy the cameras from the park elsewhere. Unfortunately, a lot of the uh, settings that he has uh, set up here are not visible because uh, the file is missing. Um, and I've not been able to uh, find the file again. It's going to take a little bit of searching to see if we can find it. My guess is that we probably won't be able to uh, that's what happens when you put things on a form and not like on a blog. Um, anyway, all editorial comments aside, let's uh, see if we can get that to work here. So uh, we'll, uh, let me uh, get the uh, game over here where I can see it. There it is. And uh, let's see if we can get it to work this time. I've tried this before and I've had it fail. So uh, we'll see if we can get it to work this time around. We'll go to info, we'll go to ballpark and add a ballpark. And uh, we will create a new ballpark. And now we will try to manually import data from that park. There it is. There's beautiful Angel Stadium. The thing that happened before, this is specific to the Linux version, is I have to have everything in two different directories for reasons. Click on 3D model is what we do next. Um, and then uh, there is uh, a copy cameras from park um, option. So we go to copy cameras from park. And uh, we want to make sure that we uh, choose the correct park. So we go there and we go to the OTP 3D file and select no new cameras added. Then we will copy the cameras to all parks and they are copied to all parks. And now we can go and we can check up on that and make sure. So um, let's see if I remember how to choose a different ballpark. As you can imagine, this probably should be um, updated kind of so that uh, we uh, make it a little bit easier for people to use and to play around with. But um, if all went correctly and we look at the uh, cameras, we should have additional camera views, and we do. Um, and you can look at all sorts of fun stuff. You can look at YTV view. It's these home play views, though, that um, I enjoy the most. Probably not B. I think probably uh, C is probably the one that I want. Like that, yeah, that looks a little bit more like it. You can see the whole field and you can see everything that's going on. And all of that comes as part of this wonderful uh, ballpark file that um, this uh, person on uh, the official OT uh, forums came up with. So there you have it. That's uh, the way that you can uh, sort of upgrade your uh, OTP ballpark uh, images and look at it like that. Um, it's a little bit complicated. It's always complicated with OTP, but it works. And that's the important thing. I hope you have a good day and I'll talk with you again tomorrow. Bye-bye.